<laughs> oh, damn. I've always been looking to expand my my skill set when it comes to um, documenting stuff like in terms of photography and videography I've always just been trying to expand but not in a very deliberate way I've just been taking my time and um, going with how I feel going with what I want to do that day going with my readiness so I, 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 I don't know, you know, with this process of reinventing yourself, I think I do that quite a lot. And um, with, with big, giant kind of steps into a particular direction. There's this opportunity to go and study. Um, it's a program that is led um by university of cape town um single camp documentary and i can't begin to tell you that i couldn't have imagined that it would be of this magnitude i couldn't have imagined i couldn't have imagined i couldn't have thought i couldn't no no it was impossible for me to think it that way so it's day one and I'm ready, super ready. I must just quickly go to the ATM and withdraw some money and then I'm out of here. I'm ready. And as much as it won't be for like a long period of time, I'm actually grateful that I get to experience this because I've always been like, Ugh, am I gonna die without, you know, experiencing that sort of varsity life kind of thing. I know it's not necessarily varsity life, but it's a new city, so it's varsity to me. Good morning, world. I haven't felt this happy in such a while. Such a while. So, um, yeah, I'm feeling things, feeling awesome things. I am within the mountains. Okay, so I'm running a little bit late, like I'm five minutes behind at this point, which is probably gonna be 10 minutes by the time I get there. I promise you it's going to be amazing that when you see that final form screened to everyone and you stand there with your certificate in your hand you can feel such a sense of accomplishment and we, we get such positive feedback after things that people do after they do this course that I really also hope that you will all be able to benefit from it. So as I think you can tell, day one had a lot to do with theory and the different trails of thought and techniques that go into documentary making. And it was at that moment where everybody realized we did not come here to play games. Today is over. Ooh. It's been day and a half. I can't begin to tell you that I couldn't have imagined that it would be of this magnitude. I couldn't have imagined. I couldn't have imagined, I couldn't have thought, I couldn't, no, no, it was impossible for me to think it that way. 
So yesterday I was fake late. Today I'm late for real. It is now going for 9.30 and the session starts at 9 so it doesn't feel good. I don't like being here late. Those of you who have questions, stick around. Let these guys finish first and then you can go later. And select the one at the top first. And the one at the top first is always the best quality. like the day and um, today we're going to be doing a lot of activities that are going to help us kind of distinguish our roles within the um, fuck I hate how we're always just afraid of men that pass us because always thinking the worst always on protective mode anyway yeah we get to we get to do some action cut rolling slate i am excited so yeah that's what's about to happen today so we were divided into small teams of four we were given our equipment and we were doing some equipment checks before we went out to do our first shot at documentary making we're going to use each other as different subjects for the different documentary that we were going to shoot for ourselves and i must tell you it was challenging but so much fun yeah. are you ready are you ready are you ready yep i am <laughs> am i ready i don't know i don't know i don't know, I don't know. But I think I am. When I'm getting you wear the short things. You can change mm. shots in between because you know how you're going to edit that footage. So you know, okay, no, it's fine. I'll change shot here because I'm going to cut it right here anyway and pick up there. Or I'll find something and use, etc. Um, it was nice to see. I'm not sure if it's your film or whose film it was. Had like, uh, that's why I saw like voices, personal styles and, and a voice was coming through. I'm from Kailisha and my pronoun is she. The friends know me as a, a kind of a person who always loves to laugh a lot. I love to laugh a lot. I love to joke around because I find each and every situation has its, has its own sense of humor. So I'm that kind of a person. I already tell my family that um, I actually love being around the LGBTI community because they find that community is something that's kind of like um, not existing. <laughs> the one habit that I'm pretty sure that at home they don't find out is the fact that I'm a closet eater. They don't know about that. So I have like great sweets and stuff that they don't know about and I'll keep them in my closet. <laughs> <laughs> 